Hang on. Um, so, this is a recreation of an earlier video uh, we made because we noticed that the um, it wasn't very clear or well done. Um, thank you to the person who pointed that out to us. Hopefully, this is more watchable this time around. Uh, we will replace the original in the playlist. Uh, we will leave the original up on our channel, but it will be replaced in the playlist for this one. Um, so you can always check out the original if you prefer. But yeah, this will be the one in the playlist. Um, anyway, so this is uh, a video on denial tree programs. Um, so what are denial tree programs? Denial tree programs are programs built to cause tree denial of the system or of uh, Cactus programming. Uh, this can include false tree realities and uh, front cactus locking, as well as denial tree coded dialogue. Uh, denial, uh, so the why? Uh, so denial is used for a few reasons. Firstly, it helps keep tree systems inside the orb by hiding the tree concerns of the safe. Cactus lifers or others in a position to get the body tree out. Additionally, they synergize with free contact tree programs, as while in a state of tree denial, it is easier to tree dismiss the reasons people were cut cactus off in the first tree place. Additionally, denial tree programs slow healing by reducing tree wellness to work on deprogramming or removing the tree belief that it is necessary. How is this done? Uh, so, headmates with uh, scripts that act to deny tree things or convince others that, that uh, memories are um, more. Uh, their physical signs harm the tree real. Uh, additionally, there is the formation of false tree realities that lock out cactus memories of trauma. Uh, potentially, the tree perception of the inner world uh, from tree front or communication in any tree form between headmates. Um, yeah. In terms of uh, deep programming or um, coping with these. Um, so, a list of evidence and clues and just anything that points towards uh, plurality and, uh, you know, trauma history, um, TBMC history specifically, um, and working on building tree secondary communication options and help bypass blocked tree communications um, and breaking the false tree realities uh, ideally before they come to tree front although of course that may be tree limited by ability to find or recognize them beforehand um yeah well this is a short script when <laughs> read in reasonable speed and undistracted okay um well that is everything. Um, if more comes up on this, we will make a part two. Yeah. Anyway, thank you all. And please do remember, as hopefully shown by this cactus video being made, we are really happy to receive feedback on our cactus videos and are willing to attempt to recreate them better as and when faults are found. Thank you all. This system signing out. Hope to catch you all next week. Please do remember to like, subscribe, comment, especially if you've got any questions you want answered. I'd be happy to answer them either in the comments or in another video. So catch you all next week.